cracking. What are we going to do today? Well, we're in this last dribbling days of lockdown three. And in lockdown three, I've been baking a lot of banana bread. I found a nice recipe, so here we go. This one calls for four bananas in the uh, recipe, but I use five. They're not the large bananas, they're uh, the packs of five that come from Morrison's. Usually they're a little bit browner than this, uh, but these are just all I had at the moment. While you're doing all of that, you've got to get your oven preheated to 180 degrees. So I've got the bananas mashed up there. Now it's time to add two eggs. These are uh, large free range eggs from Happy Chickens, hopefully. And get that all mixed in. So the next thing is two, uh, sorry, uh, 85 milligrams of buttermilk. Now I don't have buttermilk and I'm sure you don't either, but you can make buttermilk or its equivalent by uh, using uh, one and a half teaspoons of lemon juice. Put that in and the milk with the lemon juice in it kind of froths up a little bit. So what's a bit maybe yogurty, something like that. Pour that in there. There we go. I don't want that butter to be too hard for mixing it in. So I just put it in the microwave for 30 seconds on, uh, on low. Uh, we do need as well one teaspoon of vanilla essence. I'll put that in while we're waiting. So as you may be able to see there, the, the butter has melted quite a lot. Now I just mix that in with the sugar. So there we go, that's my mix of caster sugar and butter. And now it's time to add the flour, bicarb and salt. So just pour that in and kind of fold it in as it's going. Uh, so there we go. That's all ready to put in the baking pan. So there it is in my silicone bread pan. So that's a two pound bread pan there. And into the oven it goes. Uh, middle of an oven, 180 degrees, and it goes in there for one hour. So, we'll leave that cooking, and I'll be back with you soon. There we go. Uh, at the top, see maybe a, a little bit uh, dark but that's fine uh, it doesn't taste burnt so that's good and now pop it on the cooling tray let it cool off for a little bit and then I'll turn it out to the silicone pan and that my friends is it thank you for joining me for Fanny Eng about in the kitchen <laughs>